Hi guys, I continue British and American festivity. Chapter Five, Christmas. Christian in many parts of the world celebrate Christmas on twenty fifth December. This festivity celebrates the birth of Yeshu Christ. Members of Russian and Shep. All Tudor's Church celebrate on 7th January. The history of Christmas. We do not know exactly when Christian first started to celebrate the birth of Christ. Many historians believe with this were in the 4th century, when Christmas began to take the place of the Pagan celebration of the winter shows this, the shortest day of the year. The Bible does not say when Christ was born. Early Christian properly chose 25th December because it was near the date of two pagan festivity. The the ancient Roman god of Our Greek control was down, certain, and in December the Romans celebrated certain earlier. This festival lasted for many days and includes the winter solstice. This day was an. This day was usually twenty first or twenty second December. During certain years, the Romans had parties and gave a present for, to their family, friends, and children. The pagan people of Scandinavia also had a winter in a winter festival. It's work called Yule. It also includes the winter solstice and lasted for many days. The men brought. Home a big lock and burned it. They believe the lock helped to bring back the sun. The family celebrated until the lock stopped burning, and sometimes this took twelve days. Today, a popular cake at Christmas popular cake at Christmas is in the form of a jewel lock. The tradition. Of Yulak were fir trees, holy mistletoe, cakes, and presents. They are all still symbol of Christmas. Ancient European believed that mistletoe had a magic power. Even today, if a boy and girl meet under the mistletoe, they kiss. The tradition is that this brings good luck. And it is a sign of friendship and affection. Today, traditional British Christmas comes from the Victorian period, when Victoria was queen, nineteen thirty-seven, eighteen thirty-seven, nineteen o one. Christmas then started to become an important festivity. It was a time for the family to be together, and a time to enjoy special foods, music, music, carols, and games. In in Britain, there were more things to buy in shop, and the tradition of giving presents grew. But at this time, there were also big differences between the social classes. They were the very rich and the very poor. Rich children receive dolls, dolls houses, games, and books. Poor children receive an apple, an orange, or a very small toy. Sally Dickens described the Victorian Christmas in his Christmas stories, especially in A Christmas Carol, eighteen forty-three. In this story, Dickens shows the difference between the rich and the poor in Victorian society during Christmas celebration. Prepare for Christmas. When greeting up Christmas, greeting up the Christmas tree. 
The tradition of the Christmas tree comes from Germany. Germans had a fir trees in their homes, and they decorated it with biscuits and candles. In Great Britain, the Christmas tree became popular after 1840, when Queen Victoria married Prince Albert, a German. He brought the tradition of Christmas tree to the royal family. This picture is Prince Albert, Queen Victoria, and the young Prince Edward and Prince Aguirre. Admire the first Christmas tree at Windsor Castle, 1845-1842, by Alice Cocker. Then many people start to have a Christmas tree in their homes. Today, almost every Christian family has a Christmas tree at home or in the garden. Some families put up the tree on Christmas Eve, while the many others put it up at the beginning of December. People decorate the tree with color light, and at the top of the tree. They usually put an angel or a star. They also like to decorate their homes and garden with the other Christmas symbols, such as holly, mistletoe, and paper decorations. Towns and cities to usually decorate the tree in the parks with color light. Every year there is a very big Christmas tree in. Trafalgar Square in London is a present from the people of Norway. The tradition started in 1947 when the North when the Norwegian wanted to thank the British for their help during World War II. This tree is about twenty-five meters tall, and it is decorated with white light. America's most famous Christmas tree is at the Rockefeller, at the Rockefeller Center on Fifth Avenue in New York City. This spectacular Christmas tree has about five miles of light. Every Christmas, millions of people go ice skating near the Rockefeller Tree. Shopping for Christmas presents can be fun. During the Christmas season, shops are open until late, and they are often open on Sunday too. There are always a lot of people in the shop looking for the right present for their family and friends. The shop windows have a decoration, and many towns and city put Christmas tree and other Christmas decoration in the shopping streets. If you want to buy toys, in London there is a great toy shop called Hamley. Children and adults love it. There are six floors full of toys and interesting games for all age. Another wonderful toy shop is F O A F A O Squares on Fifth Avenue in New York City. It is New York City's favorite toy shop. Christmas decoration outside horror in London. Christmas is a happy time, but it is also a time to help and remember others. No one wants to be alone at Christmas. During the Christmas season, charity organizations ask for money for the poor people and the homeless in their town. They organize free meals and often give a toy to the poor children. In Greater Britain and America, people send Christmas cards to their friends and relatives. They usually buy boxes of Christmas cards. Often from charity organization, many families show all the cards they receive. They put them on the walls in their houses. The British painter John Colcott Horsley designed the first Christmas card in 1843. The design was a family party with the poor. 
a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to you. Christmas chorus and Christmas music are very popular. Many Christmas chorus are very old. A lot come from Europe, but some American too. People sing Christmas carol in church, in town centers, and sometimes in front of their neighbor houses. If people like the carols, they'll give the carol singer money. The carol singer usually give this money to charity organization. In Great Britain, pantomimes are very popular. This wonderful Christmas entertainment is from a comic theater with songs. The stories are usually famous fairy tales such as Cinderella, Sleeping Beauty, or Aladdin. A man usually acts the part of an old woman. This is a funny part. Pantomime can be very noisy. Because the audience participate in the performance a lot, the actors sometimes speak to the audience, and the audience shout an answer. The audience often sing with the act- actors, and when the bad person of the story enters, the audience say "boo." Bantamarit are a lot of fun for all the family. A traditional Christmas day. Some Christians go to church at midnight on Christmas Eve, while others go on Christmas morning. There are special Christmas services in all Christian churches. Some people don't go to church, but on Christmas Day, families try to be together. People travel long distance to spend a family Christmas. Children and adults usually. Open their present on Christmas morning around the Christmas tree, or sometimes even in bed. This is very happy omen moment, especially for the children. In Great Britain, there is a big Christmas lunch with special food. People start cooking the Christmas meal very early, especially when there is a turkey. A big turkey takes a long time to cook. Christmas crackers are an old tradition and are part of the Christmas lunch. To people, pull the crackers until it goes bang and open. Inside, there is a small present, a paper hat, and a joke. People sometimes wear the paper hat during the rest of Christmas lunch. In the United States, families spend Christmas day together at home. They play games and watch Christmas films on television. In the evening, they have a big Christmas dinner with lots of special foods. On 26 December, Saint Stephen's Day in the Christian calendar, people in America go back to work, but in Britain, Canada, Canada, Australia, and New Zealand, they don't. In this country, 26 December is a public holiday. It is called Boxing Day. This name has two possible origins. Some say it has this name because it's because it's in the past English master gave their servant a box with small present or money on 26 December. Others say it. Has this name because churches had had boxes for the poor. People put money in these boxes, and the churches opened them on twenty six December, and gave the money to the poor. Father Christmas. Father Christmas or Santa Claus is based on Saint Nicholas. Nicholas was a Christian bishop of Myra, a town on the Mediterranean coast of modern Turkey, in the fourth century. He was famous because he was generous and kind. People start giving presents on his day in the Christian calendar. 
seat. December gradually, this custom of giving presents moved to Christmas. But in some, in some country, there was another traditional giver of presents in England. It was Father Christmas. In the 18th century, Dutch shelter took the tradition of Santa Claus, Saint Nicholas in Dutch, to New York. The pronunciation of Santa Claus gradually became Santa Claus. And Santa Claus and Father Christmas became the same person. The American cartoonist Thomas Nast created the modern image of Santa Claus in 1863. He is a happy old man with a white beard wearing a red shirt. He drives a sleigh pulled by reindeer deer and comes down the chimney with toys for children. Before the American and British children go to bed on Christmas Eve, they leave means pea, biscuits, and something to drink for Father Christmas. They also leave a Christmas stocking where Father Christmas put their present. Thanks for listening. Hi guys, I come back. This cover the real life Christmas fruits. The traditional Christmas dinner consisted of rolls, turkey, and roast vegetables, followed by special dessert. Typical British desserts are Christmas pudding and mince pies. Fried in America, fruit cake and pumpkin pie are popular. During the Christmas period, other typical fruits are rose ham, yule logs, and Christmas cake. How to make a yule log? Ingredient for the cake: two eggs, one hundred gram of white sugar, a tea grams of white flour, a teaspoon of baking powder, half teaspoon of salt, one tablespoon of cocoa powder, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, one tablespoon of warm water. Ingredients for the chocolate buttercream icing 150 grams of butter 150 grams of sugar, cocoa powder. Mix the butter and sugar together well. As you mix, add some cocoa powder. Utensil to use fork, wooden spoon, cloth, baking tray, tablespoon. How to make? Step 1. Break the egg into a bowl and add the sugar. Step 2. Put the bowl over the saucepan of warm water and mix well. Add the water and the vanilla extract. Mix the flour, baking powder, salt and cocoa powder with the egg and sugar mixture. Put the mixture onto the baking tray then put it into the oven for 10 to 12 minutes at 200 degrees. <coughs> put the flat cake on the cloth and put some sugar around it. Number 6. Cover the flat cake with some of the chocolate butter cream icing. Number 7. Use the cloth and roll the flat cake carefully into a roll. Number 8. Put the chocolate buttercream icing on the top of the lock. Use the f- a fork to make it look like a lock. Number 9. S- step 9. Decorate it with holy or other cake decoration. Christmas around the world. 
Christmas is different in the different part of the world. In the southern hemisphere, it is summer in December. So, Australians, for example, have picnics on the beach and go swimming on Christmas Day. In North Country, it is cold and there is the possibility of snow, a white Christmas. In this country, there are a lot of traditional market in December, where you can buy all kinds of Christmas decoration and present. France, Germany, Spain, Japan, Mexico, Australia, Poland, Canada, Austria, Belgium. The end. Thanks for listening.